I don't really feel like okay. <laughs> I literally don't think I've ever jumped that much in my life. creme brulee and welcome back to another episode of the Lux SMP. So today I am at spawn and I usually start at my house but I'm at spawn because look it is now fall. That was supposed to be a dramatic um a dramatic scene type thing but that really didn't work. But it's fall, and look at Spawn, it's so cute. And as you can tell, the leaves are now red. And there is red and orange and yellow around, and actually the leaves and vines that are red and stuff, that's server um, resource pack. So everybody sees, can see the beautiful autumn season thing, yeah. <laughs> But anyways, today we are going to be doing something a little bit different. We are going to be doing a scavenger hunt organized by the one and only Lori Games, which I'm actually starting on, or standing on the start. Oh, I'm actually, I was standing on it. Um, I guess I'll just show you, to be honest. Here it is, Lori's fall scavenger hunt. So today is going to be related around autumn so let's just jump right in to the video all right so here is Lori's fall scavenger hunt we have clue one and info and rules so I'm gonna quickly glance over this so it says this is a fall scavenger hunt made by Lori there will be a number of clues until you find the end prize there is a prize for everyone so please do not steal someone else's prize as it would ruin the hunt for your prize will be in a chest with your name on it. Also, please do not cheat and look at someone else's video because that would basically be cheating. If you need a hint, contact her. And anyways, good luck and have fun. Feel free to record your journey on the hunt, which I will do. So we have clue one right here. And it says, I have a million stories and books, but ones I cannot read or tell myself. When you, I think it's supposed to say go. When you go through my doors, you have to stay silent. Go to this place to find clue two. All right, so when I read that first clue, I'm thinking of the library, which I have not shown you guys, but you can kind of see it from here. It's actually a bookshelf, and I think it's a library because it says you have to stay silent, and I think that's the only place on the server which you have to stay silent but this is the library it is a bookshelf with an open book along with a quill and then we have an apple with a little worm coming out and it's adorable oh there we go so if we come in yeah it's really cute and you can get you can enchant here which I will definitely think about doing I'm gonna show you guys upstairs because I haven't shown you guys this yet 
and then you can also purchase different books for enchanting so yeah it's really cute and I don't know oh yeah here it is so clue two we were correct I am where the rich people go to turn in their gold and diamonds if you need to store your valuables give me a shout all right so rich people would have to store their valuables or currency at what I'm guessing the bank we now have the Lux Bank which is a brand new building so we're gonna head over there um it's this way it is that building right over there the really big one and I think I've kind of checked it out I don't know if I've recorded it to be honest because there have been clips where I've recorded and I've never uploaded but here it is the Lux Bank and it is complete oh yeah here it is here's the clue but before we go I'm just gonna show you so this is the bank and you can basically change your gold blocks into a single diamond or vice versa where you put in a diamond and you get an entire gold block so I feel like that's actually a really cool like way of transferring things so here is clue three clue three says I am where the mushrooms moo and I have giant ones too so I'm thinking of the mushroom biome if that wasn't obvious enough because that's where they have a bunch of giant mushrooms or not mushrooms but mushrooms <laughs> but in order to get there we have to go this way where as you can see our teleport houses are spawning we also have biomes which teleport us like they're teleport biomes I don't know if <laughs> It kind of seems self-explanatory to be honest, but we, I guess, oh, I'm guessing we're gonna have to go and teleport there. So there's like a little, oh, there's a Doug. Hello, Doug. So we have the teleport house and I don't know, do I see a chest? Oh yeah, there's a chest over here. Clue four, perfect, all right. My trees are huge. They almost touch the sky. You may even hear a small meow if you listen close. So when I think of what the clue said, I'm thinking the jungle because those trees are huge as well as have cats. That's where you can go to tame cats. So there's another teleport biome this way which we can head up and it's all red because of the texture pack but we are gonna head up this way yeah so there's little cats here but I'm pretty sure it's the same deal where I have to teleport to the actual biome it's not gonna be conveniently here so we are gonna teleport to the jungle here we are this is the teleport house and yeah here it is. And then each teleport station kind of thing has a beacon so you also don't get lost if I never mentioned that. So, clue five. I look over the whole of Lux. I am very tall, but wait, what rhymes with tall? So, one thing that looks over Lux, um, I know we have the teleport houses. And at the top, we have um, we have a tele or not the teleport. At the top, we have the city hall, and that rhymes with tall. So that's my educated guess. So if we teleport up this way, here is the city hall, and here's the welcome desk. And yeah, clue six. And I also just want to point out everything is decorated for fall or autumn, and I think it's absolutely adorable. But if we get back into this, how much would a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? Wood, wood, woody wood. So, somewhere with a lot of wood. So I'm going to go run around spawn and see if there's any wood shops because 
Oh, that was a nice teleport. I never teleport that nice. Because there are a lot of things made out of wood here. Alright guys, so as I was running around spawn, I came across this shop, which is Lex's wood shop. So if that doesn't like bring up like a really big red flag as to what it was, then I don't know what it is. So we're gonna check here and see if it's in here. Okay, it's up here. That's clever. Clue seven. I am the hottest body in the solar system. I keep everyone warm, but I am in the form of a temple. All right, I definitely know this one because I've visited this place a lot. I'm not even quite sure what this build is for, but if I can figure out which way it is, I'm thinking it's the sun temple as it is it does match up to what the description of the clue said and yeah so it's this way and I'm pretty sure that's what it's gonna be otherwise I have no clue what it would be and I kind of missed that but here is the Sun Temple so if we go up oh this is new clue 8 hold up I just want to see what all this is but Here's clue 8. We're gonna try and stay on track. I am a place everyone sees, but only Lori goes. Up on the mountain, I take her to a place she calls home. This is definitely Lori's teleport house. The issue is now I have to figure out which one is hers. That's a husk. Oh, great. Got hunger. Yep, yeah, that's, that's nice because I don't want to put on armor because my skin is so cute, like you gotta admit. Alright, so we are gonna try and find Lori's teleport house, so I will meet you guys there when I find it. Alright guys, so I am back. I found Lori's teleport house, so, oh, that's not what I meant to do. So we are gonna go straight through her teleport house. Oh. It's actually right here. Perfect. That is very convenient, actually. Alright, clue 9. We are almost there. If you press the button, there's a path of colors. Maybe if you follow it, it will lead you to where you need to go. Alright, we need to find clue 10. So, I guess we go through. Look how pretty her house is. I'm actually so jealous. Alright, um... If it wasn't more clear, I'm guessing this is the path of colors. I'm not in a very good stance right now, though. It is night, and I have no armor on, so I'm actually going to put my armor on because my sword's also going to break. So, alright, let's follow the beautiful path of colors. That's a creeper. Can I slay him? Slay. 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 Yeah, we slayed. I don't really feel like... Okay. <laughs> I literally don't think I've ever jumped that much in my life. That's a zombie. Uh, <laughs> there we go, there's the beginning of the episode. I literally... Oh. Guys, I literally just... Oh. I knew that was coming, and I saw the skeleton, and I think I... I don't even know, but I, like, jumped. I literally jumped. Like, I have never jumped that much. Okay guys, so my guess is this is the last clue. It's kind of emphasized a little bit. I'm not sure. So we're gonna we're just gonna go ahead and read it. I also have to kill a very scary skeleton. 
spooky scary skeleton. All right, clue 10. You made it, the final clue. Let's see how well you do. There's a castle over there where your riches lay. Go find them now with no delay. Go to this place to find the prize. A castle? I don't what? Oh, like... I'm gonna do some searching. I will be back. Alright guys, so I was walking by here and I think I saw one of my signs. Not one that I wrote, just like the, the pink, yeah, I think I found a sign. <laughs> So... Oh. Alright, uh, go up for more. Mine is clearly not down here. Oh, here's mine! Everybody's is just everywhere. Alright, let's see what the scavenger hunt has brought. Three, two, one. Oh! 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 The potato of truth. This is going on my wall. We got three gold ingots, a diamond, and some redstone. Oh! Thank you so much, Lori. Oh, this was an amazing scavenger hunt all right guys so that oh wait no there we go all right guys so that is gonna be it for today's episode so i'm gonna end it off here with my potato of truth in front of the one and only Lori's house i hope you guys enjoyed i had such a fun time trying to figure out everything for the scavenger hunt. I hope you guys kind of play along with me. And if you did enjoy, let me know in the comments. I'd love to reply to you. So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. And as always, love you lovelies. Bye.